Hello D Nation and welcome back to yet another unbox and review episode. In today's episode, we are going to be unboxing a 118 scale pullback diecast bike with sounds and lights which is manufactured by Speed Vertex. So stay tuned with me on this one and let's get started. And as always, let's begin with the packaging. This is a standard window type boxing with all the product branding and information. So let's go ahead and take a look at this box. And with that out of the way and as we get this unboxed, please be careful while using sharp objects and keep in mind to keep these diecast motorcycles away from children below the age of 5 as the tiny parts can be hazardous. So keeping this in mind, let's get this opened. Well, let me begin by saying that Speed Vertex is a Chinese toy manufacturer brand that makes look-alike toys. This model just made me curious to know what this was all about, so I went ahead and picked it up. So let's take a look at this model. Well, at first glance, this diecast model looks to be a rip-off of the Suzuki Hayabusa, including the paint scheme. And the build quality on this one is not up to my satisfaction and has some random details to it and looks like this model is manufactured mostly of some low grade plastic which makes them not as good as the premium license models. This model measures in at 5 inches in length, 4 inches in height, 2 inches in width and weighs in at about 120 grams. I'm not really happy with the paint apps and branding details on this one but at least it looks functional and what I'm looking forward to is that this model comes with lights and sounds according to the description on the box. So let's go ahead and take a look. Well what can I say, this is just a rip off version of the Suzuki Hayabusa and don't look forward to much with this model. The sounds and lights on this one is ok but do not expect a whole lot from this model if you are planning to get one. So with that being said now let's place this model on the D-Nation Dyno and check out its wheel spin and functionality. And kindly find further features and specifications regarding this motorcycle model in the description below. Well unlike the looks and the build quality, everything seems to be spot on in regards to the functionality with this one. So with that being said, let's place this model on the D-Nation turntable and take a look at it in a 360 degree view. Well this model is available in three variations which are red and silver, black and silver and the blue and silver which I've got. So here are a few fun facts while you take a look at this model. A pullback moto is a simple clockwork used in toy cars and bikes. A patent from them was granted to Bertrand Fred Francis in 1952 as a keyless clockwork moto. Pulling the toy backward winds up an internal spring suspension, a flat spiral rather than a helical coil spring. When released, the toy is propelled forward by the spring. When the spring is unwound and the toy is moving, the moto is disengaged by a clutch or a ratchet and the toy then rolls freely onwards. Often the clutch mechanism is geared so that the pullback distance needed to wind the spring is less than the distance the spring is engaged propelling forward. And for more information on this topic, kindly check the link in the description below.
And if you want to get yourself or your loved ones this 118 scale motorcycle model with sounds and lights, I dropped the Best Buy link in the description below. So go check it out and get yourself one if you're interested. And also please do let me know in the comments below as to what you think about this particular motorcycle model and also do let me know if I should add this to my existing collection or should I just keep this aside. And this brings us to the end of this amazing unbox and review episode. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed making it for you. And if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a massive thumbs up and share it. And don't forget to smash that subscribe button if this is your first time here. And also don't forget to click that bell icon so that you don't miss out on any of our upcoming episodes. And if you care to share your views and thoughts on this topic, please do drop a comment below and stay tuned for a lot more exciting episodes coming up. Well, thank you for watching. Take care and I'll see you on the next one.